All right, so fireworks are illegal in Maryland, but that certainly doesn't stop people from setting them off. A Maryland teenager suffered serious injuries in a fireworks accident last night in the backyard of a Prince George's County home. Fox 5's Tisha Lewis is live in Landover tonight. So, Tisha, how is he doing? Well, he's recovering tonight, Sean, but we can tell you that this explosion was so intense that we're told that this child could potentially lose some fingers. Now, the explosives that you explosives that you see here on the screen, more than a dozen of them were turned into a fire department less than 2 miles away from where this accident happened in District Heights tonight. Investigators are working to determine and trying to figure out if these explosives are related to the incident. We've all heard the warning. In Prince George's County, fireworks are illegal, dangerous, and potentially deadly. A 14 year old boy is lucky to be alive after a fireworks explosion late Tuesday night in this District Heights neighborhood. An explosion that left the teen's hands severely injured. Paramedics reportedly described the injury as traumatic. I just heard like a big boom, and then I heard somebody just scream like bloody murder. Longtime resident Dorothea Webb says this neighborhood felt more like a war zone July 4th. It seemed like bombs were dropping off in here. It was a lot of police when I pulled up, a um, couple of ambulances. It was blood down there on the sidewalk a little ways. Um, and it was a lot of people upset because they didn't actually know what was going on. They said someone threw the firework, and the other people said that the guy just lit it in his hand. Lakeisha Cole's nephew is around the same age as the victim. Fireworks, it's dangerous. You just gotta be careful. The Office of the Fire Marshal for Prince George's County Fire and Mass Department is actively investigating uh, the incident, um, which can also be a police investigation um, as well because of the fact that fireworks are illegal in Prince George's County. It seemed, it seemed like a, a point blank contact uh, on his hand. Um, he had significant trauma to, to his hand. Now, investigators here at the Prince George's Fire and EMS Department are working to figure out exactly what went wrong. There are two different stories coming out of this District Heights neighborhood. Some neighbors say that the fireworks were thrown toward the young child. Other neighbors say that this teenage boy actually lit the fires. Fi lit the fireworks leading uh, to the explosion. We do know that right now investigators are trying to answer questions like where were the fireworks purchased? Who took this young child to get the fireworks and find out more exactly about the origin of the fireworks. Tisha Lewis, Fox 5 Local News.